morning. <laughs> I kept going back and forth. Am I gonna vlog? Am I not gonna vlog? Am I going to vlog? I'm gonna vlog today. So let's spend the whole day together. just sit and talk a little bit oh yeah look at that background oh it's beautiful okay so we got this tree really recently from Lowe's right before Christmas for $99 it is frocked it changes lights it is like slender so it doesn't take up the whole dining room area it is beautiful we have our girls in the back who are sleeping um, this is a dining room table that was a gift to us and a giant window. It is lovely. The past three, three years, I guess, the three years of our marriage that we've been together have been in rentals. And then before that, for four years, I was in college. Um, this is like the first place that we can call ours that is truly like we own it along with our loan provider. Um, but it's just beautiful here. I have lived in Vermont my entire life and just to be next to a babbling brook and be surrounded by nature and see deer and see squirrels playing in the snow that are like wild rats, it is just phenomenal. I love it. I love it so much. I hope you are doing well. Thank you for taking the time to be here because <laughs> this feels so official. Thank you for taking the time to be here. No, thank you for being here and just like sharing life with me. I think that's really special. Um, I know I go through different YouTube videos and I watch different people and I connect to them in different ways. I know some people connect to me through the rats, some people through like minimalism, some through faith, like there are all different reasons for connection. So, you know, what? in whatever way we are connected, I appreciate you being here and it's, it's really cool. It is so hard getting thumbnails. <laughs> I feel like I'm doing a mini photo shoot with myself. It feels a little ridiculous. And like the main attraction here is truly the tree. I love that. So moving here has been phenomenal, not only for the scenery, but because of like the local amenities. Um, I have been getting books from the library instead of buying books. And this one was Christmas at the restaurant, Pamela Kelly, just like a feel good, hallmarky, romantic, multiple different um, character story. I loved it. I read it in basically a day, just like two weeks apart. Like I started it for a little bit and then a lot of time passed and then I finished it yesterday. It's so nice to get back into fiction books and not like self-help, like anxiety and faith and just like reading nonfiction books. Sometimes it's nice to get lost in fiction. One-sided conversations are very difficult.
And then there's like YouTubers who just never drink their coffee, like, or tea. They're holding it and they edit out them drinking it, but it's like, no, I want to drink my coffee too. There's a squirrel over here. So I have a few things that I want to get done today. One of them being dishes because it is a never ending battle. Um, it, it's just always there, always. And you know what else is always there that you can count on? Laundry. So I need to do some laundry, like some more laundry. And I'd like to exercise today, which tells me that I need to clean the green room because it got messy again. Um, I think we're minimal. I think we don't have a ton of stuff. Like this dining room is very open right now. Um, that being said, that room's a disaster and I'll show it to you in a little bit. Got to clean it again. So today's big on the cleaning, a little bit of self care. I already took a bath yesterday, so I don't want to do that again today, but I just want to exercise because I feel good. Like it boosts my mood. It boosts my energy. It's just kind of fun to dance and be silly. Um, I want to get back into that routine. Not New Year's resolution-y, not that, but just, that squirrel's so cute. But just like taking the time for myself. Just like this is time right here for us. So this would be the time where we have a conversation so, so I don't feel left out. Why don't you share what you've been up to in the comments down below or just like, I don't know, something. Um, doesn't have to be positive. Doesn't have to be negative. Just... Share if you want, I guess, if you want to say hi. I go back and forth with my husband about like who watches my videos and what they're there for and the purpose of YouTube, the purpose of the videos. And ultimately we've talked about really what it is, is for capturing the moments of joy. Um, so like moments that I might not feel joy or see joy unless I've captured them or paid attention closely to them, like slowing down, taking in the details. So sometimes I'm like, no one's going to like this video. And he has to go through that. Well, what's the purpose of the video? And it's, you know, to find those moments of joy. So like sitting here in the dining room, having coffee is quiet, except for the fridge that just turned on louder. It's quiet. There's a squirrel out there eating. There's a tree behind me. It is beautiful. It is calm. It's a moment to breathe. It's a moment where everything is just right where it needs to be. And maybe that's like, I don't know if it's cliche or maybe it's just too like earthy or whatever, but it is for someone with anxiety like me, nice to take those moments. So no matter what you're doing, no matter where you are, no matter the emotions, I hope you know that one, you've got this, whatever it is, um, that things are going to happen just as they need to, that whatever is for you will not pass you. And other people say this, and it's so special and meaningful to hear, but you truly are enough in what you are, and you don't need to prove anything. You just are how you are, and that is great. Like, you are doing what you need to do. You've got this. And on that note, I'm going to finish my coffee, not show you drinking, well, maybe I'll show you drinking the rest of my coffee. I don't know. It's up to the editor's choice, right? And that's me. Um, and watch this cute little squirrel. I want a better lens so that I can show that to you. I don't have one right now. So that's the other thing. People ask like, how do you do something? So like me, how do I get people to view my videos? Well, I don't, it just kind of happens because people are intrigued by my rats, but just get started. Like you, you don't have to have made it to do something, just start. So whatever you're itching to do, even if it's a failed attempt. So like I, I have a bullet journal that I just am not using. Um, I have watercolors that I'm just not using. I, I picked up exercising and put it back down and picked it up. Try things without fail, without a schedule, without a routine, without an expectation. Just try it. And if it doesn't work, hey, you tried it and you know. I'm saying that because the new year's coming and people put immense pressure on themselves, on each other. Advertising companies pay attention to this. They have already been advertising like diet stuff to me and I'm like, get out of here. I don't want to see it. Just go away. Um, it's not healthy. Just do what you want to do and have fun doing it. You and I have a story, you know. Surely there are some turns on the road. 
learn from all of the places we go we know the only way is up through every storm somehow we find our way what looks impossible no that can change climb up the mountain until we're on top we see where we are from we see To the top of the hill Learn from all of the places we climb But there is no limit to the sky Through every storm somehow we find our way What looks impossible, no that can change Climb up the mountain until we're on top we see Together we're strong. It's not perfect. As you can see, there's stuff in the corner, there's stuff in that corner, but it's enough room here to work out and I've been itching to like work out today. It's just something I want to do. So laying out the yoga mat, going to get a dance exercise thing up on YouTube and get changed into workout gear and do a little workout. I am so scared of falling down. I just won't climb in the first place Hold my head under, let me drown Because I'm empty space and I Can't let things lie It's alright I stay the same Give a little stargaze, sit and watch our minds change Isn't your face one I used to know? Dancing with my eyes closed, lonely on the way home Maybe I just miss being alone I'll give forever and a day Just let me sleep in this morning Say that I don't have to feel this empty
editing the first half of the vlog just to give me something to do and I want to shout out the music that you're hearing in these vlogs is through thematic which I actually found through a different youtuber um, it's free for me to use for just regular songs not premium songs and these are just regular everyday artists who want exposure so I'll leave their links down below in the description you can check them out but that's where that new music is coming from and if you're thinking Jess what's up with the really sad song during the workout I just like this song. It, it's just nice. So I, I don't know. I was listening to Taylor Swift during the workout and it was all too well. So that wasn't happy either. I don't know. It just fit the vibe, I guess. I, I don't know. I liked it. It was a good song. Okay. So next up on the list of things to do is grocery shopping. So I have some dinner ideas. We're going to do like a chicken parm, but without the parm because my husband's dairy free fajitas. Fajitas, yes, fajitas. I almost thought it was supposed to be fajitos. Like Fritos. Anyways, fajitas, tacos, a lemon chicken with veggies. We'll do a baked fish, Zupa Toscana, and the shrimp bowl. So now I need to think about everything we need, including the things that we have. So I'm just gonna put stuff down the list first for like things that are required for each meal. So like we need chicken, spaghetti, sauce um we do angel hair pasta we'll probably do like broccoli with that we need probably like steak or chicken we have tortillas i know for a fact so i won't even put that down and i know we have frozen veggies for a fact so i won't put that down so i guess that's all we need there Tacos, I know we have ground beef, we have fajita, we have fajitas, fajitas, they just keep coming up everywhere. Um, for tacos, I know we have tortillas, we have ground beef, but we probably need some more salsa. I don't need any sour cream, I want to get avocados. Um, ba -dum -bum. we'll probably do like a little lettuce. Baked fish, we need a fish. And then I want to do like asparagus or something. Zupa Toscana, I used to have this stuff memorized, so I know we need sausage. Gosh, what else do we need for Zupa Toscana? I don't even remember. I guess we're looking it up. Where's that jump to recipe button? There it is. Um, bacon bits. Bacon bits. We have garlic. We'll just do frozen onion, which we have. We have stuff for that. We have potatoes, actually. Oh, look at all the money we're saving here by things we already have. Um, I'm actually not a big fan of kale. I actually prefer spinach. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is go through the pantry and like find the things we have, kind of like a scavenger hunt, and take things off the list that are on here that we have and don't need. Um, and then I will go through, we're going to do an order to go. It's just cheaper and easier for us. We'll pick it up tomorrow because my husband has the day off. I'm on break. Yay. Um, yeah. And then hopefully someone's motivated to cook all week. <laughs> and then do dishes. Dishes are never ending. My goodness. Okay. I am break. <laughs> The angle's a little funny, but I have a delicious eggnog sugar cookie that my dad and his girlfriend brought over. So good. Um, now I'm looking for a Christmas audiobook or something like the book I was reading. There's nothing by the author on here. I'm doing some searching on Libby, which is an app that connects to your local library card. So now I just need to look. I just typed in Christmas. None of 
these are looking like the book I read. It is getting dark because that's just what happens in winter. Um, but my husband and I are going to go pick up pizza. The delivery person is not available today. So we're going to go pick it up and then we'll see if I film anything else. If not, if we don't have a wonderful night, day, whatever it is. See you next time. If so, which will probably get some B-roll. Keep watching. <laughs>